What is up, comic creators? I'm gonna show you quickly how to use filters here in your CapCut project. So when you have your timeline all laid out and you have your footage that you wanna add a filter over, the first thing you'll do is in the top left-hand side of your screen, there's a tab up there that says filters. You click that and then you'll open up all the options you have for filters within in the CapCut software. It is uh, really extensive, they got some really cool ones. I'm gonna scroll down to where it says nature. Um, and I want to go down there. Obviously, we're in a forest here, so I want to see what we can do with our nature uh, forest setting. So here's all the filters they have for nature. You can kind of, when you click on them, it'll give you a sample of how it changes the footage. And so you can click through and see what's best for your uh, project. Um, they have one in here that's really interesting. Uh, I think it's winter. And when you click it, it looks like it's winter in the forest. It's crazy. So once you have what you wanted, you go ahead and click it and grab it and drag it into your uh, project and lay it over the clip that you want. Now from there, uh, you just have a few options for editing it. When you click it and highlight it in the right hand side of the screen, you'll see uh, one option up there that just allows you to adjust the strength of the filter. As I move that bar to the left or right, you'll kind of see the winter uh, look effect fade a little bit. Um, other than that, you can grab the edges of it and you can stretch that filter out across uh, the entire clip or even your entire project of whatever you're trying to uh, have that filter effect over. So I'm going to stretch it all the way out through my nature scenes here um, and that allows it to show uh, through the entire uh, footage. You see it looks winter all the way through. So pretty good stuff right there. Um, and that uh, uh, really gives you a rundown of how we, to utilize uh, filters uh, throughout CapCut. You can overlay filters, like you can add more filters on top, but it's it'll get really wonky and kind of defeats the purpose as you do that, and unless you're looking for a really weird look. In that case, go for it. So anyways, I hope that helps. Uh, let me know in the comments below if you have any questions. Thanks. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please take the time to like, comment, and subscribe, as it helps us to further please our YouTube overlords. Check out more links in the description for continued assistance on your CapCut projects, and please keep your arms and legs inside the craft until it comes to a complete stop. Be sure to mind your headspace and watch your step as you exit. Failure to comply may result in serious injury or death. We will see you next time, Comet Creators. End transmission.